Hello YouTube, Cameron from Cameron's Car Reviews here. Now I know I haven't done an automotive news update for quite some time now and I wanted to do an automotive news update for you guys here and I'm going to be going over three topics. Um, two cars have been previewed before the 2016 New York Auto Show. That's the new Honda Civic Hatchback as well as the 2017 Acura MDX. Also, Kia is considering launching a competitor to the BMW 3 Series. So let's go ahead and check out those topics and let's get more in depth on those topics. All right, before we get started, I wanted to remind you guys to follow Cameron's Car Reviews on Snapchat as well as Instagram and like us on Facebook where you can find all of my latest upcoming reviews as well as you could see some pretty cool photos of some vehicles too. Now the Acura MDX is getting a pretty extensive overhaul for the 2017 model year and it previews a very distinctive look for the Acura brand. Now a single teaser image of the 2017 MDX shows a very stylish exterior with a very low and wide stance. The redesign is part of Acura's new precision crafted performance initiative too. The 2017 MDX will boast substantial design enhancements as well as many more added luxury comfort and convenience features and advanced new powertrain technology. Earlier this year Acura said its new look focuses on high contrast details and the intersection of modern sheer surfaces and muscular organic sculpting. Now pricing has not been announced and launch timing and technical details are later to be announced too, but the MDX will be designed by the Acura Design Studio in Torrance, California and will continue to be built at the company's Lincoln, Alabama plant. Now, key competitors of the vehicle include the Audi Q7, BMW X5, Infiniti QX70, as well as the Volvo XC90. Now the Kia GT concept that debuted five years ago at the Frankfurt Auto Show the new sports sedan from Kia is looking to be based on that concept vehicle. Now it's supposed to be a new rear wheel drive sports sedan that targets the likes of the BMW 3 Series, Audi A4, and the Lexus IS. Now the sources said that the car will be positioned between Kia's most expensive model, the Kia K900, and the front wheel drive Kia Cadenza. Now no pricing has been announced on this vehicle or when it's exactly coming out, but the GT concept from Kia is a rear wheel drive sedan with a 390 horsepower, 3.3 liter turbocharged V6 engine and an eight speed automatic. Now Kia's sister brand Hyundai will introduce a rear wheel drive three series fighter next year called the G70 as part of the launch of the new luxury Genesis brand. But we'll have to see next year if Kia will roll out a new rear wheel drive sports sedan. After being absent for more than a decade, the Honda Civic Hatchback returns for the 2017 model year. Being based on the new Honda Civic generation, the new Civic Hatchback will target other hatchbacks including the Ford Focus, Kia Forte, Mazda 3, and the Subaru Impreza. It boasts a very aggressive new design for the five-door Civic model, and Honda said in a statement that details include dual rear spoilers and twin center mounted exhaust tips. Now this new Civic hatchback looks very similar to the Civic sedan, especially in the rear of the vehicle. It may be hard at times to tell the difference between a Honda Civic hatchback and the new sedan. Now expect this new Civic hatchback to be released to the dealerships later this year. All right, so that's my automotive news update for this week, but I want to know what you guys think. So comment on the comment section below and be sure to like the video as well. And do not forget to like Cameron's Car Reviews on Facebook and follow us on Snapchat as well as Instagram. I'll provide links in the description. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Remember that this is Cameron Birch from Cameron's Car Reviews.